Hello YouTubers! This is a video about RV supplies and tools. It's uh, focusing on what you can buy at Harbor Freight and how much you can save on essentials that you will need. You thinking about buying a motor home and it will really stretch your budget to go pay several thousand dollars and then you realize you got to spend a couple thousand more dollars on dishes, on extension cords, on hoses, on uh, treatment supplies and uh, tools and all kinds of things you will need that didn't come with a motorhome. So today we're looking at the best deals I found at Harbor Freight. Um, let's start off with one of the most expensive is this tool kit. This is a $40 tool kit and when you apply the 20% uh, off coupon you're getting it for $32 which is great deal because it comes with socket and ratchet all kinds of pliers and all kinds of fittings metric and sae allen wrenches um all types of drill bits a few wrenches tape hammer sockets screwdrivers that has nearly everything you will need to do light work light work weight work on your motor home and not a bad deal at all for $32. If you bought these things separately, they'd probably be 100 Next thing is a low-profile bottle jack. If you ever need to change a flat tire and it's on the front, you're probably not going to get any other jack that you can carry around unless you have a big floor jack, but get it up under the axle to raise it up, change the tire, or whatever you might want to do. These are $40. Again, you can add the buy it with a 20% off coupon and get it for $32 and that's a great deal for a 20 ton jack I have a high profile also I carry with me but this one is um, the only one that will fit and this is another little tool kit it has three um, ratchets and metric SAE sockets and even some deep sockets and this is this was only I think these are about $29 so if you got it to spare, you'd have a lot of extra fittings there and wrenches and extensions and so forth. So that covers this kind of tool. All right. The next thing I like to have is um, a tire kit to fix a patch of tire, a tubeless tire. And many times if you have a tire that's leaking and you look at it and you find a nail in it, you can use some needle nose pliers and pull it out and patch it without even taking it off. These um, patches that you push down in there are a little small, but you can go over to Walmart for $5, you can get 30 And if you've got a big hole, you can put a couple of these in at one time and stop it up. And then it's good to have extra glue because the first time you use this glue in here, it's probably going to get hard. And it's good to have the extra glue. And at Walmart, that's like $6 and the glue is like $4 not too much then an air compressor this one is only eight dollars and believe me it will pump it goes up to 150 uh, pounds of pressure and it runs off of a 12 volt i was moving some lockers one time that we were putting in a school and i bought several hand trucks and one of them had a flat tire and i put one of these on it and went back in the truck to get something by the time i got out i heard a big pow and it overinflated the tire and it blew blew it off the rim so they will definitely put the air in there you just got to get the uh, 12 volts to it and i'll talk about that in a second the next thing is drill bits you could pay five or six dollars for a few drill bits but you can get this 30 a 29 piece drill bit for eight dollars usually on sale it's usually about 15 dollars. i paid 11 but it's on sale starting at the end of this month so they're they're on sale quite a bit the little light here with a hanger on it, they, those are free. When you buy anything at Harbor Freight, you can get those for free. Just find the coupons. And the 20% off coupons are online. This mirror is like two bucks. They're great to put on your visor. I have one right there. And I can look in it before I pull out and make sure I didn't leave a cup of coffee sitting on the counter that's going to fall off and splash all over the floor. And I'll have to make another cup. So I brought bought one for that side. So my... Uh, co-pilot can also check in the back just by looking in the mirror rather than getting up uh, of course it's a good pair of scissors they're 88 cents these knives are good utility knives that fold up 
uh, they're about five dollars and these things here are really good they clip on they got like a cigarette lighter clip uh, socket inside and they clip on a battery I got a couple of them because they're so useful in a motorhome you especially any older model over five years old is not going to have phone charging stations and places to recharge uh, anything or hook in a laptop and all that unless you're sitting in the driver's seat or passenger seat so what I do is I take them and I cut these off and then I put these little ones on and then I can take a one inch drill bit and drill a hole and stick these in from the back side and they stick in perfect I'll take you over here and show you I think I covered this in another video the clips, this is the fuse box. The clips just clip to the back of the fuse box and into something like um, a bolt sticking out of the floor that's holding the seat in to ground it. And then I can plug in a, um, a, a phone charger and then I can even run, run it up and run it into a multiplier. And then you can have the 12 volt for these 18650 batteries. They run uh, headlight. Uh, uh, yeah, headlights <laughs> that go on your head <laughs> and you keep those charged up so that's what that's good for I also have one back here I put right in that corner I'm running some electricity in here and I put one there so if I'm laying in bed and also will run a little light like this it's got a switch on it so I can just turn the light off there I'll cover that later when I cover a, a, some of the other things I've done but that pretty much covers the Harbor Freight shopping, and it will supply you with some tools that you need and without spending a whole lot of money. Thank you, and look for more of my videos. I'm making about four or five today. Bye-bye.